the symptoms of rapid heart rates in atrial fibrillation are not directly life-threatening. You your heart will never go at a life-threatening speed the way some dangerous rhythms can make your heart go at, and AFib is not one of the directly dangerous life-threatening heart rhythms. But unfortunately, AFib also has one other problem that is potentially dangerous and life-threatening, and that is this risk of clots and strokes. Now, the standard way of having a stroke is that you just live long enough and get old enough to form cholesterol blockages directly in your brain vessels that cut off blood supply to your brain and cause a stroke. And that actually has nothing to do with atrial fibrillation. That's you getting older, having a bad diet, high cholesterol diet, smoking, diabetes, high blood pressure, family history, blah, blah, blah. Just like you could live long enough to develop blocked heart arteries, cholesterol blockages in your heart arteries that cuts off blood supply to your heart and causes chest pain, damage, and heart attacks. And that has nothing to do with atrial fibrillation. That's you getting older, having a bad diet, high cholesterol, smoking, diabetes, blah, 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 all those things. 